Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Lewis, Lewis Speaks 2020. And today I want to encourage everybody, you know, stop spending so much time with people and places where you have no stock and where you have no influence. I realized that a lot of times, you know, in my younger days, I went out to the bar and I supported these bars and I basically went out there and I was giving my money away, spending time, having a couple of laughs here and there. But you know something? In the end, I realized that I had no stock. I had no buy-in. You know, the people there were friendly, but they weren't friends. You know, when the chips were down for me, when I found myself on hard times, when I needed help moving, there was nobody who was there for me. You know, that was at that bar. You know? And... At that moment, that was my first taste of realizing just how important it is to make sure you deal with people in places where you have some kind of stock, when you have some buy-in. You know, if people don't really value you, if they're just friendly with you, but they, they never go out of their way to hang out with you and really get to know you, you know, what what's the point? What's the point of all that? That's just the Hollywood. A lot of people out here, they're just giving you Hollywood. They're just being fake with you. You know, I know a lot of people who recently deleted me off of Facebook. I guess they didn't like what I had to say in terms of my posts. And so they deleted me off social media. And then when I see them in the street, they want to say, hey, how are you? How's this? How's that? Nah. I ain't got no time for people like that because like I said, that's all fake. That's fake. And it's time that we start getting real with ourselves in 2020. It's time that we start knowing where we stand in 2020. It's time we start knowing exactly who is our friend, who got our back, who's our people. Because like I said, it's, it's getting to a point where we're reaching the end time. And we can't keep pretending and faking and being around people that don't have our backs. You know, as I mature, I realize the importance of dealing with real people and making real friends, not friends who are only down for the good times. You know, you got a lot of people out there who are there to attend the party, but very few people are there to help you clean up, you know? So you gotta know who are the ones that are there to help you clean up. You know, because like I said, everybody can come to the party. Everybody wants an invitation to the party, but nobody wants to help clean up. That's not gonna happen. You know, 2020 is definitely a wake up call. You know, currently we're in the midst of a pandemic, you know, the coronavirus, and you start to realize what's important. It really helps you to set your priorities and know exactly what you want from your tribe and your circle. I know me personally, I want a tribe that got my back, that's real. I don't want a tribe that wants to sit up there and only be around me when I'm doing well. I want a tribe where I have some stock, you know, where I am valued, genuinely valued, not just value for my patronage. So I'm still working on building that because it's been real hard trying to find real people these days. But I realize that the more I treat myself good, the more I attract that energy to me. And so I've attracted some great people in my life so far. And it just feels good. It feels good to just be able to breathe and be able to just give without worrying about whether or not you're going to be taken advantage of or there's no reciprocity. You know, it's it feels good to just give with relief, where it's safe to give, you know, where a person won't let you give out. They'll keep on replenishing you. You know, that feels good. You know, I had enough of dealing with vampires, vultures, snakes, bloodsuckers, people that just want to drain you of all your life force and never replenish you. Nah, nah, I'm done. Especially narcissists. Narcissists are really good at just draining all your energy because they really don't care about you. They don't have the same compassion and interest in human lives. They don't have that. They don't have the capacity to care. You know, that capacity is just broken in them. So it feels good to really, really be able 
to just let your hair down and just give without reservation, you know? And that's when you know you found the right people, when you're able to just give and it be okay because you know that they'll replenish you should you give out. They won't even let you give out, you know? They'll put a cap on you. They'll be like, no, no, wait a minute. You're doing too much. Let me do something. Beautiful. So 2020, it's really, really, really important that you start knowing your circle. It's important that you deal with people and situations and places where you have stock, where you matter. Because going to these bars, going to these clubs, going to these these venues where you have no say or no stock or that people just discard you once 4 a.m. hits, nah, you need something better. You need something enduring. So put your energy where it builds. And that's how you make sure you'll never go emotionally bankrupt. You know, invest in what appreciates. Period. So this is Lewis, Lewis Speaks 2020. I wish everybody a wonderful night.